Yo dudes, this is Lady Fantastic. I'm going to do a, something a little different for you today. Um, not sure if you guys are familiar with the YouTuber Robert Galvin. Robert the uh, Comics G-Spot Galvin. Um, he is a really great guy. He has his own channel and his own um, Instagram. Um, if you enter the combination of words, uh, Robert... The, G -spot, the comic books G-Spot, uh, something, you know, to that effect. There's so many words in it. I just call him G-Man. Um, anyways, uh, he's a great guy, and he um, he's gotten some stuff from me, and he sent me some care packages, and, like, just a cool dude, and we were talking today, um, and basically he, he gets um, quite a few things from us just because He's up uh, north, and he said he's about 80 miles from his closest, the closest LCS. Uh, that is not the case for me. Uh, I actually have them ready to go easy access. So uh, he kind of just throws out feelers, and I try to find stuff for him. And um, he started a box with me, and basically this box is filling up. He was just like, dude, uh, don't ship it to me until it hits about 50. And uh, I've got this little priority mail uh, medium flat rate box, and it's getting close. So um, he was like, yeah, what all did I get? And I'm like, dude, <laughs> how about I just make a video? And so what I'm going to show you guys is what's in the G-Man's box. Um, <laughs> uh, and so here we go. Um, starting off, uh, this is one that he got from Shorty, uh, Michelle Shortbox Padawan. Uh, she's awesome. This is Adventure Comics, uh, number 353. Uh, all right. So this has got, uh, featuring Superboy and the Legion of Superheroes. Not gonna lie, I'm not super familiar with the older DC stuff. Uh, especially when you start to get into the 12 cent realm. It's really not my bag. Um, and that's okay. Um, he got this one for me. This is War of the Gods, um, one through four. So two, three. Got that Perez goodness. And, and four. Uh, here we go. Uh, City of Bane. This was just an awesome deceased variant cover. This is number 80 and uh yeah that's a sexy book dude uh detective 580 that's a really cool uh two-faced um speaking of two-faced uh we've got this i'm just trying to bring um it's like whenever i move these i try to like i want to try to scooch it closer because again like i said kind of anal retentive i guess that's good since i work in science and Sometimes the little things matter. I know it drives certain people crazy. Um, I'm sorry. Okay, so, uh, two, Showcase 93, Two-Face, Nightfall, number 14. Oh, hey, Spock, look at that. There's reflections there. Oh, but this is G-Man's. <laughs> uh, the Deceasing. Uh, deceased, A Good Day to Die, number one. And this is the, uh, I can't, I can't remember what movie this is over, but it's, a. Uh, one of those homage variants. Um, Invaders number five. This is just a hell of a cover. Like, what the heck, man? You got friggin' Red Skull just like reaching down like the block, uh, <laughs> grabbing, you know, a few of these invaders. Uh, did I say Defenders? I think I said it. It's the invaders. My bad. I, I'm not good with the words sometimes. I blur. Blah, blah, blah. Um, Invisible Woman, number one, some Adam Huge, Huge, Hughes, um, art, um, and I can't remember which one of us found it, but I know, like, uh, either Shorty or I, like, we both know that you like Star Trek, um, I don't know, maybe you bought this, I just can't remember, but it's Picard and Data, and it's badass, um, and then G-Man likes his Red Sonya, so... Let's do this. It's a, He's got a 22 She-Devil with the sword. Um, he really filled out like all these little um, side thingy-majiggers. Um, uh, Sonya versus Thulsa Doom, number three. Um, uh, and then number four. Uh, and then look, so 
I can't remember who it was, but somebody bought you some Red Sonia's uh, G-Man and gifted it to you, so I threw it in your pile. But because of that, you now have two Red Sonia Zeros, she down with the swords. Because one you bought, and then another one, um, I can't remember who, but he bought like a lot. And uh, yeah, they're yours now. Um, could have been, it could have been Steve Whiting, but I can't remember. Um, Savage Red Sonia... Queen, or Scott Farr, it was Scott Farr, your boy Scott Farr, definitely, that was him. Um, Savage Red so Sonia, Queen of the Frozen Wastes, number three, and number four, um, and then we've got, wait, hold on, okay, and then Red Sonia, Doom of the Gods, number one, I'll bring that kind of closer to you, so I know you don't want to see it, there you go, um, Let's see. Savage Sword of So... <laughs> Sorry. Sword of Red Sonia, Doom of the Gods, number two. Uh, oh, wow, look at this, brother. Sin City, number one, a dame to kill for. You may have gotten that from Shorty. I think Shorty and I both ended up having a copy, but I can't remember. I'm pretty sure you did. And you got this one from Shorty, I think, too. And this one's Sin City, uh, that Yellow Bastard, part four of six. So this is Sin City, a dame to kill for, one of six. And this is that Yellow Bastard. Uh, shit. Did I do that? Man. Whatever. I'm just... I'm just going with it. That Yellow Bastard. I blame him. All right. Whatever, man. Life happens. Okay. Now, this is your little last chunk. Okay, so G-Man hit me up today and, like, um, he, 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 like, he's, he gets a lot of books when I do the auctions and he's like, dude, I'm just gonna send you, like, 40 bucks and, uh, I'm just gonna get a bunch of books from you and just, like, kind of tabulate and I'm like, all right, dude, all right. And so... You know, there are certain books that he'll see, and he's like, hey, what about this? And I'm like, okay, it's yours, dude. So, this was one, um, I actually showed it in my video yesterday, but he's he said, hey, uh, you know, I really want to get this. Um, there's someone I have in mind for an A-OK, -okay. and, you know, honestly, guys, like, I could hold on to this, and it would be nice, and it would be really cool, but it really is gonna be in the if if he wants to give this as, a, as an a-okay -okay, i think it's just gonna be a much better home for it you know what i mean and he asked about dead man i said dude dead man's yours and blade was the last one because he is a big time vampire uh horror kind of junkie so he had got the um blade number one and the max which is badass you know uh, what else you got here vengeance of vampirella that's not particularly surprising so, yeah, well, G-Man's kind of got a theme here. Uh, Morbius, number 18. Oh. Is that like Spider... There's somebody in his... And then uh, Morbius, uh, number 17 of the that run. And then he got Weapon X with Domino, number 3. Uh see uh marvel team up spider-man and doc samson this is a cool cover bro 102 and it's in nice condition so well played brother um and then he got um so this is uh wait it's not this one but actually it's marvel comics presents number six is supposed to be the uh, wolverine's um daughter or something first appearance but this is a see this is a third printing of that and then number seven that actually shows like a first like yeah uh, and then this is the second printing of wolverines uh yeah uh, number seven i'm not sure if this was the first one that had the cover with her on it i don't know you know like you can we could figure it out but i'm not sure and oh, okay he's gotten some silver surfers so here is a 52 and a 71. Usually if I find doubles of these, I try to just throw it in the G-Man pile because he's a big Silver Surfer dude. Um, Sword of the Atom, number one. And ending it up, that is a Marvel Comics Presents Cyclops of X-Factor, number 22. 
All right, G-Man. That's a lot you got for me, bro. So I'm going to um, upload this, and you can uh, see all the nuggets you got. Take care, guys. Bye.